Graphic design, in many ways, it's creating identity. At least it's creating a way of understanding what you're listening to, looking at. We create ways of saying, you know, this is you know, the auditorium. Uh, this is a certain street. This is a certain... So I do a lot of work in the, uh, the urban environment, cities mostly, and in institutions in cities. So a lot of the things I deal with have to do with the general public. And we all know, you know, how easy it is to get lost in the city. So I think that's one area that graphic design can be very helpful. I've, you know, had some success there. And I, like I say, I want to continue working there because there has, there's a lot of challenges. And I think the technology can help, but it also can make things overcomplicated. So that's the challenge. You know, as far as communication is concerned, language is a very small part of our history. Now, communication is probably something that's been going on as far as we've been around. You know, we Neanderthals and Homo sapiens seem to get along. I don't know what they were talking. So when you think about that, our communication is probably less based on language than it is on many other ways of us communicating. Body language, signage systems that are built into our our physiques, we're able to kind of communicate without any specific language. Now, one of the things as a graphic designer that you have to deal with is how do you go beyond different languages when you're talking to an international crowd? Or, you know, and it's a big problem. Language becomes a barrier rather than a help in so many in instances, in so many situations. I had that experience working with the Olympics that it's possible to transcend these language barriers not just to identify sporting events, but there's a lot of things that can be important part of an urban environment. And that's where I've been really focused and I'm absolutely convinced there's so much that we have to learn there. And, you know, language is great, but boy, it doesn't work when you're talking about multi-language. Let's talk about communication. And that's where the, the graphic design part and the visual part can play a much better role, bigger, bigger role, and uh, maybe can be helpful in ways we don't understand yet.